Brothers Bistro. Recipe so simple, even a dude can make it. Hi, I'm Skinny Kenny. I'm Musclehead Kim. And, and we're, we're the, the Clark, Clark Brothers. Brothers. Welcome, Welcome to Brothers, Brothers Bistro. Bistro. Wow, buddy, what have we got going on? It feels like it's been a long time since we've done an episode. <laughs> well, you've been out fighting fire. I don't know if you've been lighting fires or fighting fires, but you've been gone for quite a while. Well, they we called me again, so we're doing this rush, <laughs> rush thing, trying to get these episodes well, out. We got some new unis. Did you notice? Yeah. I like it. Yeah. I, I, does it go with all of our new subscribers? It goes with our new subscribers. We got 258 wow. subscribers on YouTube. And how about Facebook? Well, I got my hair cut for the Facebook post. <laughs> there, may be, there may be some single women out there. <laughs> There might be. Almost 1,500 Facebook wow. likes. Wow, wow. We use a little different vernacular okay. on Facebook. But yeah. We had okay. a Facebook outage yesterday. Did you check that oh, out? Oh, boy. I <laughs> bet you went through withdrawals, huh? <laughs> Yeah, yeah. All right. Hey, we got some we got some cool artwork Swag. from a, from a fan. Look at that. That one actually looks like me. That one doesn't look like you. Oh come this on, one. that looks just like me. <laughs> this thanks, one looks like me. Thanks to Allison, she did a bang up job on these. You you rock. Allison rocks. Definitely. If you guys want a personalized uh, painting or a mug like this, you let us know. We'll hook you up with Allison. That's right. We might have a giveaway on one of these things, huh? We might. And did you notice mine was dark and yours is light? Yeah, why is that? I'm the evil twin and you're the good twin. Oh, that goes with our national That's debut. Right. That's right. right? Our national TV Our debut. Halloween is coming up. And you guys are going to be blown away. We're only going to tease at this point because it's still three or four weeks away. That's right. We're waiting to hear all the details, but we will let you know as soon as we know. Oh, it's pure knucklehead. <laughs> pure knucklehead. You're going to love it. <laughs> Okay, but tonight we got a nice recipe for them. We do. Is it simple? Yeah. It's is simple. it easy? It's simple and easy. And it was a good, easy to shop for. Easy. I think it was easy. You did the shopping. Yeah, it was pretty easy. The hardest thing to find <laughs> was the feta cheese. Okay. I was in the cheese aisle looking for. Has anybody ever else done that? Is it looking for the cheese? The feta. Well, man, if you can't find the oh. cheese, I don't know. We're gonna have to send out a, a, a search party. Okay, so we're doing chicken, grilled chicken. Okay. Everything happens tonight on the barbecue, which is super fun because it's kind of fall. That's kind of a fall thing. Well, do, and right? for us. It's a rec tech. That's true. We got the rec tech. Rec tech, we're looking for an endorsement right. deal. Are you listening? Yeah. So, rec tech, we're going to rec tech everything. And we're going to get sliced zucchini with lemon and feta cheese as our green, our veggie. So, that's a little highbrow, right? Yeah, yeah. And the chicken is just queued up. Chicken is just queued up. Normal thing. I mean, we'll walk you through the basics, but nothing really special about the uh, the chicken. We just want to get them right. on there and make sure it's well done. Well, it sounds like it was pretty easy. I know when I went shopping, you know, I had to find the mint, had to find the, the not cucumber, I had to find zucchini, <laughs> and I had to get the feta cheese. Those are the toughest things. He finally the knows the difference between <laughs> zucchini and cucumber. That's right. Mike White, are you listening? <laughs> <laughs> So, we'll be right back with the ingredients and we'll show you what we got to go. We'll show you how simple this bad boy is. Be back in a jiffy. Wow, we're <laughs> back. <laughs> and it looks a little more complicated than I Holy thought. Holy shit. Okay, boy. but it's not that bad. Let me walk you through right. it. Yeah, so, first of all, we're going to do the chicken. Walk I can do the chicken. Thing. This is, okay. I put my Montreal steak seasoning, or actually chicken seasoning, right, right, right. on this. And wait, I, wait, I got wait, that wait, down. We're still looking for them, McCormick's uh, endorsement deal. <laughs> Have you heard us? We we haven't got our mail. It just seems to be clogged up. We're yeah. not getting anything. Maybe when we hit the national spotlight, they'll come. Yeah. Back. <laughs> Maybe. Okay. No, they're gonna have to pay big bucks to get us there. <laughs> All right. So then we've got not Cuc cucumbers, zucchini, <laughs> sliced up, sliced kind up of thin. You About know, a half inch, thin. half inch thick is what we did, right? Half inch thick, and we got a little bowl here. Now we're gonna transfer these to a bigger bowl because we're gonna put all this up. Olive oil. Kosher salt, right? Yes. Where did the kosher what salt go? What is the go? deal with kosher let me, salt? Let me, get, let me show you the kosher <laughs> salt. And black pepper. We know what black pepper is. Morton's kosher salt. Now, Morton, Morton's could be an, an endorser. We maybe know. maybe the priest that, that blessed it is. <laughs> <laughs> there probably is. There's got to be something like that going on to make it kosher. All right, really so knows. kosher salt is a little coarser than normal salt, and it mixes up better. So this recipe called for kosher salt, so that's what we got. And then after these things come off the grill, right? But we don't want them to fall through the grill. Well, we got to, yeah, we got to put them on. We got to. So put we got to put basket. them on our grill basket, right? That's right? And this big bad boy is something you can get on Amazon. We got it in a day and a half. Right. So, you know, and you can find the product uh, affiliate link the right affiliate there. Link, right? right. Just click on that bad it, boy. Yep. Find that in the comments and order up. This is this thing. This is a beauty. <laughs> and then when it comes out of there, we're gonna add the lemon juice. 
Okay. The lemon zest. Show them the zesters. Show them the zesters. Oh, right, right, right. We got this zester. So it's it's a little bit like a cheese grater, right? But you just rub it on the side of the, the lemon. And it takes a bit of work to get even that much <laughs> lemon zest. I mean, it's, it's kind of a But it does have some flavor. I guess that's why they tell us to do it. Yeah. And then the juicer. We got good at the juicer. The juicer, yeah, yeah. The juicer, we, this is our third or fourth time using the juicer. So we're <laughs> experts now on the juicer. And a lot of lemon juice comes out of that lemon. Not much lemon zest. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. We had plenty so, of juice. And, and then and not the a lot final of ingredient is the feta cheese. That's that, right. That took my brother so long to find in the we grocery We gotta store. cheese it up. Yeah. And oh, we got the mint leaves. They'll, they'll be in there mint too. leaves. Mint. Look at this. Growing live <laughs> mint leaves. <laughs> we pulled it out right out of the ground almost, and then chopped it up and or pulled it apart, and <laughs> we gotta put it on there so we get lots of flavor. So that's the deal with that. All right. So we're gonna come right back. We're gonna show you our big bowl of cucumbers. Zucchini, Zucchini! Buddy. We're gonna show you our big bowl of zucchini and we're gonna have it displayed on the grill <laughs> just when we're ready to go out to the grill. All right, so we'll stand by, we'll be right back. All right, wow, so that all boiled down to I nothing. Know, right? So we got the chicken. Look at that, it all fit yeah. in that little basket. <laughs> Holy shit. So we balls. got the chicken, you did your normal thing. We, right. we seasoned one side with the Montreal. That's right, because you don't want to get it too seasoned, too salty. Right. Because yeah, it ends salty. up being a little salty if you do both. So we got that ready to go. We're going to use the rec tech, which will tell us what the internal temperature is. What's the internal temperature need to be for chicken again? It's 145, 150. Okay, so 145. Like and then we pull it off and it cooks a little yeah. bit longer. And, and and we'll put this, look at this cool little zucchini uh, basket, right? So we were able to get everything on here. We didn't think it would all fit, but it did. So we're going to do this and we'll cook it for a few minutes and then we'll flip it over. And we'll, they'll get nice and grilled. And then we'll bring them back out and we'll put on the extra extra condiments. So hang tight with us. We're going to be right back after you see it all actually fully cooked and really kind of ready to be plated or plated, right? All right, be back. All right, we're back there. Ah, ah. Hey, look, it turned out pretty darn good. Oh, look at man, that. Man, the chicken looks chicken. amazing. And look at that. Look at the zucchini. Woo! Or that that cucumber. Pretty... <laughs> That's zucchini. All right, so we got a we got a lot, final. Uh, little... We got our lemon juice. We're gonna pour that over there. We got our lemon zest. Pour right. that over there. Right? And we got our, our leaves, our mint leaves. All right. And we're going to mix that up here like this. A little, you know, steer it up. Steer it up. Okay. And then we're going to pour the feta cheese on. That's our kind of our final. <laughs> that, hey, give me that. That looks yummy. That looks yummy. All of a really sudden yummy. you turn from not looking so wow, good to looking great. buddy. Huh? This was a good idea you had. All right, so let's let's uh, let's, look at that. let's let's wow. serve it. So serve me a right. chicken breast. Here's your chicken breast. We got okay. we got six ounces, Turn it right? Here. Yep, six ounces of chicken breast. I'll bread. give you about half of this because that's how I'd roll. Okay. Okay. Look at that. Good. That looks pretty good. Let me, we got let me, another chicken breast. Let me get this down. Okay. Here. All right. Just because I have it. Like, yeah. Yeah. That's, that's fine. Okay. I can I can smell the lemon. Yeah. And the, uh, the, the good, mint. Huh? And the mint. Okay. And, and then the breast. Chicken breast over there. Chicken breast. Okay. Nice. There's that. Get these out of the way here. And then we gotta we gotta test this baby. Taste tester. Look at that! Holy cow! All right, so. Taste well, a little, the, bit, of the, 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 little the, bit of the little bit of the zucchini. The zucchini. <laughs> what? You said cucumber. <laughs> the zucchini first. Let's do, we'll do a little taste of the zucchini because because yeah. the chicken and we know we can do that. That's pretty good, right? Yeah, it's got got a little lemony. Yeah, I definitely can taste the lemon. Definitely taste I like a little bit of the mint cheese, too. The, the feta, feta cheese, cheese is really good. All right, let's do a little bit of the chicken. Okay. Nice job, bro. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's, That's good. good. So, listen guys, this wasn't that hard. Uh -uh. I mean, the hardest thing was finding the mint and the feta cheese in the grocery store. Right. Chicken was pretty easy. Problem with chicken in the in the uh, store is that it, they tend to give you a pretty big chicken breast. Yeah. 
So yeah. So you, you want to make sure you get it down to six ounces after it's cooked. That's a full serve. And it's about seven ounces. It shrinks about an ounce or two, yeah. right? Yeah. Something like and that. And then in this case, we got the cucumber. And, the, and, and the really, this was only like two zucchinis, one for right. him and one for me, basically, right. Right? right? And a little bit, one of those little things of the mint, a little container of feta cheese. Yeah. It yeah. was all kind of right there, all included. The lemon, we were able to zest it and juice it and do the whole yeah. thing. Now, the, that takes a little, that's a little deceiving because the lemon juice you can get out of a single lemon, but the zest takes a little bit, so you might need three or four lemons to get the right amount. Of and the salt. zest gives a, a little bit of a zip, it's right? It's pretty cool. So if you didn't want to do the zesting, I could, I would say you could probably buy just the lemon juice in the store and, yeah. you, you know, probably get away with alternate it. it. Yeah. So, so in, if you get this a chance and you want to let us know, put it in the comments that you're going to try it and let us know how it turns out. We would love to hear from you. Yeah. And if you haven't, we told you before, but we'll tell you again, hit those notifications, turn on the subscribe button. And give us a thumbs that up. that like. Yeah, give us a thumbs up. Let us know <laughs> you like what you're seeing. And we'll be back before you know it. That's right. Brothers Bistro, out. out.